planted on the launch pad at the Overberg de Naltesh range outside Arniston, the Phoenix 1B sounding rocket appeared ready for takeoff. As part of the University of KwaZulu Natal's aerospace research program, the test was part of a plan to develop enterprise in rocket propulsion technology. The plan? To send payload carrying rockets into short suborbital flights before returning to Earth. Master students and industry experts waited in anticipation to see the two year old project take off. Sounding rockets have already seen great appeal for experimental purposes in fields including astronomy, astrophysics, and biotechnology. Four, three, two, one, zero. While the rocket didn't do as well as initially planned, students, engineers and technicians are heading back to the drawing board hoping to learn from the incident. The motor ignited. Shortly thereafter, we lost visuals on it. We only have cameras very close to the motor of the rocket when it took off. Um, and so we don't actually know what the cause of the failure was. Um, what we have to do now is we have to undertake a forensic investigation of this. We have to look into the high-speed camera footage. We have to look at the parts of the vehicle that we've recovered. And once we've done that, we'll have a better idea. Um, so that's as much as we can say at this point.